And then we also have things called work order list production. There are two things that we can do. We have first production schedule items. Um, and a production schedule, think of as, hey, we make these items all the time and uh, we just want to produce them on a regular basis. We don't want to have to generate work orders or job orders. We don't want to have to have people, you know, clocking in and out of each operation on those. We just want to know that uh, they, they need to be made on a regular basis and the folks in those areas know that they need to make them. Uh, this way we're only reporting time if needed to an, to an actual resource as opposed to a job. And the only thing we do is report the completion of that item and it knows to back flush all of the materials and labor for the uh, bill of material and routing for these production schedules. Uh, so it's a, a great way to get jobs through the shop that you make all the time. They're a standard cost. I'm not concerned with capturing actual labor hours or, or actual um, material cost within it. I do want to back flush all of that uh, because I want it to schedule and it will still schedule what it thinks it needs to, to, to make it, but it's not going to force you to have to scan completions or, or in and outs or, or create uh, material issues for those jobs. And then the other thing is the just-in-time production transactions, which this doesn't hit the schedule. You don't pre-schedule these. These are just things that come along that you just want to make, um, you know, off the cuff that, hey, you know, we need to produce this part. We ran out. Maybe it's, maybe it's replenishing Kanban. Uh, bins for a manufactured part. So all we do here is tell it the item we made, how many we made, and if it's lot controlled or, or traced, we can enter that information too, and that's it. We process it and it will also back flush a standard bill of material for us, uh, but no need for a job order, any barcoding or work orders, or, or doing any transactions other than saying, I made it and here's how many I made.